Hey Leute, der ist hier zurück mit einem neuen Part von Eleanor hey. und... Let's get Ey, musst du mich jedes Mal, wenn ich einen Part neu anfange, nerven? Ich fange ja schon an. Ja, ja. Und wir verhören jetzt mal, äh, befragen jetzt mal hier die junge Dame. Yes? I'm Detective Phelps. This is my partner, Detective Bukowski. Lassen wir sie erstmal sprechen, was sie gesehen hat. Can you tell us what happened? Well, I came to the window because I heard people arguing downstairs. Mhm. Also sie ist sehr selbstsicher. Then what happened? I saw a car hit that poor man and knock him down the street. Dann beschreibt mal das Fahrzeug. What kind of car was it? A dark red Lincoln Continental. Das kann ja fast nicht sein. Das muss eine Lüge sein. Die Frau kann niemals die richtige Farbe und die richtige Ty Typenbezeichnung eines Fahrzeugs. Blaues Auto oder sowas. Ja, ja. ja aber sie sagt schon die Wahrheit. Did you see the license plate? Only the first three letters, I'm afraid. Three, C, eight. Ja, was haben Sie denn beim Streit mitgehört, gute Frau? Tell me more about the argument you heard. Well, there were two voices. A man and a woman. That's all. Irgendwie glaube ich ihr das gerade nicht so ganz. Aber ich setze jetzt mal Intuition ein. Hm, anzweifeln? Ja. Why are you holding out on us, Miss Perry? I'm sorry. I was hoping to tell my story to the newspapers. I'd like to get my picture in the paper. I'm trying to find work as an actress and things are pretty difficult. Cough it up, sister. We don't have all night. People arguing? They were husband and wife. I could tell by what she was yelling. Intimate things. Very embarrassing for the man. Thank you, Miss Perry. Your information has been very helpful. We can go now. Oh, I good. Really think so? I hope you find that driver and put him away. You certainly got away with the dames, Phelps. <laughs> Give it a rest, Bukowski. Let's see what the patrons have to say. I'll take the bartender. You work the rest of the room. Um, haben die ein Telefon? Ich guck mich erstmal um. Ich würde mich versuchen, beim Erkennungsdienst mit Hilfe der Autonummer. Ich will den Wagen ausfindig machen, halt den Besitzer. Only one possible make on that license. Registered to a William Shelton, 738 West Temple Street. Thanks, ma'am. Looks like we caught a break on this one. Okay, jetzt gehe ich zum Bartender. I'm Detective Phelps of the LAPD. How can I help, Detective? Name would be a good start. Dudley Lynch. Hired help. I run the place when the owner ain't around. Where is the owner? He stepped out. Somebody had to take Lorna, Mrs. Patterson, home. What can you tell me about the accident? Not a lot. It was busy in here, and all I heard was the impact. Ich glaube ihm das nicht so ganz. Ich weiß nicht, ob er lügt oder nur eine Halbwahrheit erzählt. Eine weg. Okay. So what was he doing outside? It's against licensing regulations to drink on the sidewalk. Mr. and Lorna were having a fight. The owner made him take it outside. It was pretty ugly. Do you know the victim? Yeah. Lester Patterson. He's a regular here, or he was. I think he said the truth. Not one of your favorite customers? Lester was special, but... Not my kind of special. Was Lester drinking alone? No. 
He came here with his wife. She didn't seem too interested in the booze, though. A witness overheard an argument. Lester and Lorna. There's nothing like airing your dirty laundry in public, is there? Hmm. Das glaube ich ihm nicht so ganz. Das war nicht alles, möchte ich meinen. Why was Lorna Patterson in such a hurry to leave? What is going on here? Lorna was pretty upset, so Leroy took her home. Lorna and Leroy are close. They've been talking about opening a new bar. Leroy. Leroy Sabo, the owner. Okay, da fragen wir ihn gleich noch danach. How long have Lorna and Leroy been talking about this new bar? Who knows? I just served the drinks. Das weiß er. Jetzt macht er hier einen auf selbst sicher. Uh, ich bin mir nicht sicher. Ich glaube, das ist sogar eine Lüge. Aber da gehe ich noch mal sicher. Na, dann ist es bloß anzweifeln. Okay. Bartenders hear all sorts of things. Are you going to tell me, or do we have to start playing rough? When Lester was drinking, he treated Lorna like dirt. He gambled away all their money. Lorna pitched Leroy about the bar. I don't know how interested he is. Is Leroy doing well? <laughs> Hell no. The only thing keeping this place afloat are the poker games. Thanks for your help, Lynch. I'm gonna need you to sign a statement with the patrolman. Sure, no problem. You get anything out of the regular? They weren't giving too much away. They liked watching Lester and Lorna go a few rounds every other day. And Lester was a fan of the love tap. Hm. Poker runden. Okay, wir trotzdem mal schauen. Das wird mich ja doch mal interessieren. So this is why everybody comes to raise. Ich weiß nicht, ob ich alle Hinweise habe, aber da werde ich jetzt nicht noch einen Punkt Intuition verschwenden. kommt eine kleine Zwischensequenz bei sowas. Courtney. Come in. Have a seat. Thanks. How are you finding working at the clip? It's uh, fine. Are you sure? Can I be honest with you, doctor? I would hope so, Courtney. I was hoping that the therapy would be more beneficial. Treatment can unfortunately be very long term. So many of the patients here are addicts, doctor. Many of them have been for years, Courtney. In the past, these people were condemned in sanatoriums. We can reveal the root of the problem. Then we have a chance to help them. And until then, they stay sedated? Do I detect a hint of reproach, Courtney? I was expecting more, Doctor. I'm sorry. I don't mean to criticize. Part of being a physician, Court, learning to be patient. How is it possible to keep so many of them on their medications, Doctor? Many of their addictions are illegal. Oh, many things in life are gray, Court. What may on the surface appear to be illegal is actually a benefit to society at large. Das stand jetzt so sicherlich nicht in der Zeitung drin, aber diese Sachen geben alle nach und nach im Spiel Sinn, auch die Flashbacks mit der Army. Real happy this is when you marry a girl for love and you find out later. Okay. 
er da noch mal was vielleicht? Sorry, Phelps, do you mind if I get on with this? Na. Ich überlege gerade. Wir haben nach was für eine Lebensversicherung über den Toten. Das Auto haben wir aber auch noch. Ich werde mal als allererstes zu dem Besitzer des äh, Autos mich, mich aufmachen. Jetzt muss ich selber mal gucken. Moment. Äh Moment, 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 Moment. Ach, da hinweise ich bin auch doof. Äh, wem gehört denn der jetzt nochmal? Äh, dann wird das Scheltens Wohnsitz sein. Pattinson ist ja der, der gestorben ist. Ah ja, genau. Fahren wir da mal hin. Mit Krach natürlich. Muss, ne? Lucky break getting a partial ID. These cases are usually dead in the water after 24 hours if no one comes forward. Why don't they just stop? You heard about fight or flight during the war? Sure. Never back your enemy into a corner. That kind of stuff? Right. Well, in a hit and run, the perp is already in flight. It's easier to keep going. It takes a degree of moral courage to stop and accept responsibility. You're not as dumb as you make yourself out to be, are you? <laughs> I didn't know I was making myself out to be. Da steht er doch schon. Wie gesagt, also ich glaube nicht, dass der direkt mit dem Tod... Ja, er hat ihn halt über den Haufen gefahren, aber... Das hat, glaube ich, mit dem Tod in dem Sinne nichts zu tun. Die Beweise zeigen eigentlich noch eine andere Sprache. Das zeigt auch, was er, dass er jetzt ein bisschen schlechtes Gewissen hat. <lacht> Au. Hey, ordentlich das mitgenommen. William Shelton? Yes. <lacht> Doesn't look good, Shelton. You packing your bags and making a run for it? You know why we're here. Yes. The accident. We've got witnesses who can put this car at the scene. Not to mention the physical damage. This is open and shut, Shelton. Okay. That coward thinks he can run from everything. Eine lustige kleine Verfolgungsjagd. Warum eine querfeld ein hier? Take this guy out. Oops. Lay into his wheel arches. Come on. I wonder he killed someone driving like this. Don't let that asshole get away. There were people around. A woman and a man were standing right next to him. I thought they could get him to a hospital. I'm telling you, it's not my fault. The guy is dead, Shelton. You can't be serious. William Shelton, you're coming downtown. We need to talk about a manslaughter charge. 
Leave the coroner and the paperwork. Procedure can wait. We should probably go speak to the wife and let her know what's happening. Okay. You become all hard at the prospect of paperwork, don't you? Jetzt fahren wir zum Wohnsitz von Pattinson. <lacht> Sorry. It's my fault. So, im... Um Also ich glaube dem Fahrer sogar, äh, was er gesagt hat. Aber das können wir später noch alles feststellen. Erstmal fahren wir zu Pedersons Wohnsitz, zu seiner Ehefrau. Quetschen die aus. Und da sind wir auch schon... Halt! <lacht> so. Schauen wir uns doch hier mal um. <lacht> Erstmal klopfen. Hello? Mrs. Patterson. Is this about my husband? We're investigating the incident, ma'am. I see. Come in, won't you? Dann gehen wir doch mal rein. Can you tell me what happened? What's to tell? He got hit by a car and now he's dead. You don't appear to be too upset about this. Lester and I met on a furlough in 44. We got married that weekend. People don't understand it now, but that happened a lot back then. I see. So you probably did well to stick it out this long. What's that supposed to mean, mister? I think it's about time you left. I have someone here. I think I have You're going to have to run that one by us again, sister. It's okay, Lorna. I'm Leroy Sabo. Well, well. Nice to see you're comforting the grieving widow, Mr. Sabo. All right, wise guy. Do you have any intelligent questions you would like me to answer? You can confirm Mrs. Patterson's story. Lester lost at cards. He was kind of hard to control when he lost his temper. He turned without looking and walked right out in front of the car. It wasn't good. What's your relationship with Mrs. Patterson, Mr. Sabo? We're friends. Good friends. You expect me to believe that? Look, I was filing for divorce. Mental cruelty. Lester could be a mean son of a bitch. And Lester knew about that? No. I hadn't told him. Well, hasn't this worked out well for the two of you? I feel almost bad for busting in on this little rendezvous. How did the car come to hit Lester? He walked straight into the path of an oncoming car. She looked as cold. You're lying, Lorna. You pushed him in front of the car. If you think you can prove that, I suggest you arrest me now. I would have loved to push him under ja, the car many times. Ah, that's funny, But not this time. Mist. You were arguing in the bar and on the sidewalk. We were always arguing. So what? Don't lie to me. Something was different this time. <laughs> You're clutching at straws. I versuch's mal mit dem Versicherungsbrief. You married? Wieder yeah, nicht. Never any different. Uh. The bartender said that you and Leroy were planning to go into business together. Can you explain how you'll get the money to do that? I have a little money saved away. Sie lügt schon wieder. You're being economical with the truth, Lorna. You want to back that up, little man?
Widerlich, ey, das gibt's doch nicht, ey. Verdammte Axt. Ich würde am liebsten die Bude noch kontrollieren. Mist, 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 Mist. Haben wir uns richtig schön in die Nässen gesetzt. Das ärgert mich tierisch. Äh Nein, Waschmittel ist uninteressant. Das Nudelholz ist, glaube ich, auch nicht wirklich wichtig. Hast ein sauberes Küchenmesser. Scheint kannst du fehlen an dem Brett, die anderen liegen. Bäh. Ja genau, er wurde tot gelöffelt. Die zwei essen hier in Seelenruhe. Ach, das ärgert mich. Keine Antwort richtig, obwohl ich wusste, dass sie lügt. Die Beweise wären ja eigentlich auch stichhaltig gewesen. Verdammte Axt. Aha. Ach, der ganze Tisch ist verdächtig, nicht hier. Das wäre eher das. Ach. Hm. Vielleicht kann ich beim Telefon noch was machen. Wo ist denn das Ding jetzt? Ich sehe es gerade nicht. Hä? Bin ich jetzt doof? Hallo? Telefon? Was ist denn das Ding? Eben hat es mir doch die ganze Zeit angezeigt. Ach. Operator, give me dispatch. Versuchen wir es mal. Putting you through now. Phelps Badge 1247. How can I help, Detective? Are there any messages for me? Just one detective from the coroner. Message mm -hmm. reads, Phelps, see me at Central Morgue immediately. Results of the Patterson autopsy. Thanks for your help. Okay. Gut, dann werden wir jetzt, auch wenn wir gefehlt haben, im nächsten Teil uns mal auf den Weg zum Gerichtsmediziner machen und schauen mal, dass wir vielleicht da noch irgendwelche Beweise gegen die beiden Halunken hier im Haus haben. Und ja, ist schlecht gelaufen jetzt. Keine Frage, richtig. Oder die falschen Beweise ausgesucht. Ja, wie es weitergeht, sehen wir beim nächsten Mal, Leute. Ich bin der L. Ich bin raus für heute. Macht's gut. Bye.